Welcome back family. I pray that you're having a blessed day today and that you're making it a priority to spend some time with the Lord. Today the Lord is talking about access. I had a vision of a person and they had a wristband on, you know, like the kind that you would wear to get into a vacation club or um, any type of access, you know, to a concert or something like that. And they had their name specifically on the wristband. And then the Lord began to speak to me about access. And he was saying that he has granted all of us access through Jesus to the Father first and foremost that's the most important thing but also the Lord was saying that through this access to the Father then we have access to so many other things that we've been asking the Lord about how many of you have been in this place where you're asking the Lord for very specific things and maybe you've been discouraged or you feel like Lord do you even hear me do I have access to such things thank you Lord and, and the Lord is saying this to you today that yes he's granted you this access but this is something that you have to keep in mind and be careful of he also was saying this that some will have that access denied we you know we know the scripture that says lord lord i did this in your name i prophesied in your name i cast out demons in your name and god looks at them and says get away from me i never knew you you are workers of lawlessness and the lord is saying this to you today that he wants thank you lord thank you lord he wants to make sure that you stay on the side of access granted and not access denied so take this word as a word of encouragement and be joyous about it but also take it as a time to self-reflect and ask the Holy Spirit to reveal to you any areas in your heart or in your mind even that you have been putting before the Lord anything that you have been putting before the kingdom even when it comes down to gifts because remember in that verse it said God I prophesied in your name I cast out demons in your name so that means that they were walking in certain gifts but remember also gifts and callings are without repentance so that doesn't mean that you are walking in submission to the Lord. It just means that the Lord is using you and God wants your whole heart. He wants your whole heart. That is how you truly gain the access that Jesus gave to us when that veil was torn. So make sure that you receive this word, hear it fully, bring it before the Lord and praise the Lord for him even sharing this message with you. All right, family, I'm praying for you. Be blessed and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.